Oh dear. What's happened to your face? Wow, I've never seen it like this. This is, these waves must have been huge. <laughs> heading down to the beach. It's a nice morning, we'll have a bit of a look. It's cold. Oh well, it's getting a bit warmer now. And um, today, our Premier is going to tell us if and which restrictions will be lifted. So hopefully, we can travel within Western Australia again soon, because I really want to go on a trip with little Lizzie. For now, down to the beach. Also, whoop, there she is. Today is Mother's Day. My second Mother's Day. And last year's Mother's Day, Izzy was three weeks old. And um, it was a pretty horrendous morning, I remember. Actually, a horrendous day until the afternoon because Izzy was just crying and crying and crying. And nothing would console her. And in the afternoon, Mark took us for a drive down to Two Rocks, oh, up to Two Rocks. And that was actually really nice. So we decided we're gonna make this a little tradition and we're going there today as well. For the second Mother's Day and you're so much nicer. <laughs> oh. Love you. Oh dear, what's happened to your face? What's happened to your face? <laughs> Let's get it all clean, hey? That's good. <laughs> Whee. The Premier just gave an update and we can travel a little bit from the 18th of May just not in the direction I wanted to go to. I wanted to go north but um, yeah north still remains closed because over here it's going to go into winter now and if you go south it's obviously going to get colder um, but north it's going to get warmer. So yeah, we'll have to we'll have to wait a bit more. Anyway, so Izzy just had a really nice long nap and we are about to head up to Two Rocks. Izzy stuck. Are you stuck? Hang on. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> did it. <laughs> Alright, let's go. different now isn't it Mark? Um, the spot? <laughs> no. Is it the world? The world? That's Good morning. It is now 7.20 and Izzy is still asleep. Oh, I've been up for an hour already. <laughs> I can't sleep in anymore. It's ridiculous. Anyway, is he still asleep? I'm gonna get breakfast ready now, um, a coffee, and um, get Izzy ready, get myself ready, and then we have to go and get um, a flow shop. Good morning. <laughs> did you sleep well? What did you find? That's microphone holder. Thank you for bringing it. How are you this morning? <laughs> you well? Nein? Just learned to say no in German. Nein, nein. Nein, nein. <laughs> What's that evil look? <sighs> <Ooh -wee. laughs> 
Excited, she doesn't know what's about to happen here. But that's okay. We'll walk down to the car, eh? Alright, let's go. There we go. There you go. This is post vaccination. It's pretty happy. Are you happy? Have you been a good girl? Very brave. Very brave. <laughs> I have gotten myself something. I've gotten myself a sewing machine. I have no idea how to use it. I'm going to learn it though. And then I'll become a super seamstress. <laughs> Look, my first cook my my erstes um, Nähprojekt. Isabella hat's auf dem Kopf. Ah, fein. Mensch, guck dich mal an, Mäuschen. Hat die Mama genäht? Hat die Mama genäht? <lacht> süß! Süß siehst du aus! <lacht> Hello, little red riding hood! <lacht> We're going outside now. It has been super, super stormy the past few days. And rainy. And... Apparently the swell was massive. So I think going down to the beach might be really cool now. Izzy's wearing her outdoors outfit. <laughs> so she doesn't have to worry about getting wet. And we are on our way. Ha ha. Good my. Look at that. Look at the colour of the water. Jesus, that's a real stormy colour. Little Izzy is walking nicely on my hand. You're doing a great job. Whoop, what are we gonna do now? This means the waves, yeah, and everything, and the storm came all the way up here. All the way up here. What are you doing? You having a little rest? Yeah, the water is still, oh geez, this is a high tide. Look how close it's coming. Wow, I've never seen it like this. Wow, look how close the water came. Usually this beach is at least down to there. Watch out, Izzy. Wow. A little bit further up here, the water's coming. Wow, I've never seen it like this. This is, these waves must have been huge. Like I did here, it was like an eight meter swell or something. And um, I saw some quite dramatic looking photos of um, some of Perth's beaches and jetties and that. But yeah, you see we have to stay up here. Water's coming too close. This is, wow, even now. Still got some waves that look pretty big. See this clean line here behind me? That didn't exist before. That's the water, the waves crashed against it and washed it out. Like all along. See? Didn't exist. As a young girl, it feels were mine. We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, playful and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl. Also, I just got news. I heard on the news that the interstate borders are going to be open by this Friday so that means we can travel up north which I really want to do so we'll see Mark's not super keen on going but um but I might take Izzy on a little trip with me we'll see we'll see but I can now plan 
which is awesome. I really, I really, really, really want to go see it. Because we can't leave Australia yet, we're not allowed to leave Australia. But if we could go within WA North, where it's warmer, that would be fantastic. Izzy, what do you reckon? Do you want to go on a trip with Mum? One big smile across my face We used to dance our way to church on Sundays Look, they're cleaning up already behind us. Remember, is it The bit of driftwood and seaweed that you stepped over? It's all cleaned up now. Well, that's Izzy's entertainment for the morning. <laughs> oh, bless her. <laughs> back from the beach and it is time for a little nap for the little messy here. So hang on. Oh no. We'll take this off and then we'll put on your little sleeping bag. And then we'll read a story. Come here after. Oh, good little helper. Read this one. Lizzie Nonsense. You like that one? Is that Lizzie? <laughs> All right, come in then. In your little, in your little sleeping bag. When Papa takes the sandalwood he has cut into town, it is fifty miles along sand tracks, and it will be away a long time. Then Lizzie and Mama and Baby are all alone in the little house in the bush. either planning a trip or be on a trip <laughs> but um, yeah we'll see how we go alright so see you next time bye bye seven days of eternity seven days in another country every cell screams stay right here and my legs they freeze us in fear